Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. So today we will be unboxing and reviewing Shadow High Series 3 Creepover Party Twyla. And Twyla? I don't have any Twylas yet so this is gonna be interesting. Daughter of the Boogeyman, not particularly a fan of that but I think she's cool. I really like original Twyla from G1 so like a lot of other collectors, I thought it was kind of odd that they randomly chose Twyla and this to be like the doll we're introduced to her in like G3. It's kind of strange. And like I said, a lot of other collectors kind of felt the same way and it was just really random because why? Why would Halloween's best friend be having a sleepover with Claudine's friends? But again, the storylines for G3 are a bit different than G1. So, I mean, I guess that's gonna be interesting. This was the only Twyla at my Target, so luckily she had a good pace. I'm terrified of her bangs, but you know what? I was willing to cross that bridge when we came to it, and it's time to cross the bridge, my friends. So, I wasn't initially gonna get her, but I was like, no, she's actually really cute and intriguing, so this is gonna be exciting. I think I watched a review of her a very long time ago, so I don't really remember a whole lot about her. Now, really quickly, I just wanna let you guys know I am legally blind, so if I describe something a little bit off to you, that is just how I see these dolls through my eyes, and I stress that, especially with this type of video, because Creepover comes with a lot of little accessories. So, without further ado, here is Miss Twyla, up close and personal. I love her makeup. It's really, really pretty. And her bangs, yeah, see, they don't look, they don't look half bad. They're like curled under just a tad. Not bad, not bad, my friends. And it says Monster High on the side with the skullette with the artwork and the other three ghouls down there. Creepover party. This one's box was actually pretty good. My Draculaura's box was ruined. So this is her artwork. We're gonna start with Twyla's accessories. Now she has this little thing, which, forgive me, I'm assuming this is a clip because it does look like it goes into this hole. This took me forever to get out. I am very sorry that I cannot tell what it is, but it's okay. Moving on, we have her bunny sleep mask. I think this is so cute. Like, look at it. It's adorable. And her color scheme of purple and blue is very, very prominent in all of the accessories, and I love that. Then we have her little backpack or overnight bag, whatever you want to call it. It is this green and purple. Did I say purple and blue? She's very purple and like teal-ish green. So purple and green. See, it's very late. I'm so sorry, you guys. Anyway, she also has this little drink. So maybe a coffee, you know, for in the morning or hot chocolate at night. I don't know. This is her eye coffin. It is a bunny purple case that is so cute. Oh my gosh. Twyla comes with a lot. She also has, I'm a big fan of this. She's got a Pop-Tart. I am a Pop-Tart girly. I love Pop-Tarts. What's your favorite kind of Pop-Tart? Tell me in the comments down below. Mine is strawberry. Then she's got this little book here. And we have Dustin, our little dust bunny. So, so cute. I absolutely love this and I love his ears so adorable the only thing about dustin is dustin a boy i think he would be i don't know anyway the only thing is i just unboxed count fabulous and count fabulous got a bed and dustin doesn't so maybe they'll have to share i don't know the pets are gonna have their own little sleepover so now i'm gonna show you all miss twyla here she is and i'm going to go ahead and take off the bunny hat in a moment but i wanted to show you all her in her entirety but i'm not a fan of this it looks really ridiculous i'm not gonna lie to you all so i'm gonna go ahead and take that off and fix her hair up a little bit more and then we're gonna talk about her all right so i removed the bunny hat and i did go ahead and i brushed her hair now her hair is very soft it's got like this crimp to it it looks kind of frizzy so i might do some taming of her hair but i did brush it out and i put some styling aid in it just because it was super super not gelled it was just it was very dry so it's very frizzy on the ends here but it's actually draculaura's was perfect i didn't have to do anything to it this i had to do a little bit too but she looks very very cute the bangs are totally gelled but once i wash the rest of her hair the bangs will not be getting touched as you can see she's got these spider earrings which uh that's kind of terrifying but it's okay it's all right. Here is her gorgeous, gorgeous face. She is absolutely adorable. Like I said earlier, I love her makeup so, so much. Here is her little nightgown, I guess you could say. And I was a nightgown girly. I guess I still am a nightgown girly. She's got this black sparkly bow and she actually comes with a bracelet as well. So you guys can see that. And it does 
have this belt that I believe is, yes, the belt is detachable, so that is very nice. Look at all of the details on her arms, and they go down to her legs as well. That is so cool. She's really cute. She has kind of like a, she's a, she has a pink hue to her, doesn't she? Interesting. Okay, and then these are her, I guess they would be her slippers, but I guess she is not wearing slippers yet or this isn't a nightgown and I'm just thinking it is and this is like her she's arriving to the party she's crashing it I don't quite know yet but I'm gonna tell you all right now I did not expect to be super like as impressed with Twyla as I am right now once I fix up her hair and flatten it a little bit she might be one of my favorites in the Monster High collection and that's saying something she's really really cool her colors are not typically colors that I gravitate towards on dolls <laughs> she's not pink so I mean yeah, she's got the pink hue to her, but she's very interesting. I do like her. I think she's super unique and beautiful, and I'm really, really glad I went ahead and I made the jump and I purchased her. Let me know what you think of Twilight in the comments down below. If you have not already, give this video a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button to join the fam, and tap that really cool notification bell so you know the exact moment I post a new video. Have a blessed day, and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye, everybody.